Hey folks, I'm back. Today I want to talk to you guys about something. Something in terms of relationships. That's right people, who actually wears the pants in a relationship? I'm here to clarify something and that thing is this. It's not about he or she wearing the pants in a relationship, but there are people out there, there are spouses, there are couples out there where it's clear cut, they're always going to wear the pants, they're the, they're the dominant force so they're going to dictate the relationship. Now, at the end of the day that may not be a healthy thing, that may not be a good thing because it can work against them. If there's no mutual consultation, then there's a lot of confrontation. That is going to go without saying people. But, now, check but, this out. Who decides who wears the pants in the relationship? It's not about he or she. It's about working together. And how you do this is this. Not in every single situation, the man has to man up and take care of that situation. It can be the woman. It depends on who is the most skilled and equipped to deal with that situation and circumstance. Who can lead best in whatever situation that may unfold. And this keeps on alternating from the male or the female. The female may be equipped, she may be better to deal with, with this circumstance that may arise than the male and vice versa. So it's not about the man wears the pants or the woman wears the pants. At the end of the day it's about working together, that's what the defining factor is. If you are dominating and dictating a relationship then you're not really relating, you're not really understanding each other's needs and you're not able to understand where each, each person is coming from, where each other is coming from. That is the thing that I want to try and bring to your attention people. It's not about dictating the relationship. It's not about doing the manly macho thing about the man needs to take charge of, of each and every single situation because sometimes if a man does this he can make the situation worse because he may not have the right skill set or the attitude and approach to deal with this specific situation people. But his partner might, and vice versa. It's about identifying each other's skill sets and trying to complement and contribute in terms of working together. That's what it boils down to at the end of the day, people. That's when you know you're in a healthy relationship, when you're able to consult one another but not dictate one another. That is what it's about, people. So, I hope I've established my point. Take it on board. Let me know what you think. By all means, leave a comment below. If not, stay silent and do something about it. People, until then, take care, stay strong, stay focused. And always live to learn to empower and inspire the lives of many, as well as yourself. Bye for now.